Well, the Flames didn't win last night's game during the Battle of Alberta, but one Flames fan scored a fiancé here at Rogers Place after proposing to his partner, who was cheering on the Oilers. And luckily for him, she says yes. I was freaking out. I couldn't believe it. Oh, my God. Peyton Partaker got down on one knee while in a large crowd of orange and blue. I was like shaking because I made sure and planned that when I was going to do it, it was the Edmonton had to score because I knew she would be standing and she wouldn't be paying attention to me. That's when I'll bend the knee and then next thing you know, 21 seconds in, I'm like, oh, I got to do this already. Art Raham, a camera operator for Sportsnet, captured the entire proposal on video. Most times when I'm there, uh, I'll warn people that, yes, you're going to be on TV at some point uh, during a goal. When I had talked to uh, this particular gentleman, he uh, he said, yeah, that's fine. And then he leaned into me and said, uh, I'm going to propose to her. And I was like, oh, all right. <laughs> Mom's the word. <laughs> Went back to my position and uh, wouldn't you know it, 20 seconds into the game, he's down on one knee and I'm shooting it. There we are. It's a classic Canadian love story that's putting a smile on Edmontonians' faces. Oh, he's proposing? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Honestly, I think that's beautiful. The reason is, is because there's a lot of enemy territory around him, yet he still had the courage to do it, and she said yes. That's, that's really cute. That's definitely put a smile on my face for sure. Albertans know how to have some rivalry fun when it comes to the Battle of Alberta. But this couple isn't letting it get in the way of love, both cheering on the same team as their late fathers, who both recently passed away. They both loved us so much that... We probably brought them to tears, even though they're not here. We know they're both happy. As for which team their daughter cheers on. She's literally our Battle of Alberta. That's what we call her, our yeah. half and half. <laughs> Despite the Flames losing the game, both Partaker and Moniaz walked away winners. At Rogers Place, Laura Krause, City News.